Hello everybody and welcome back to Roguelike Roulette. We are playing Risk of Rain 2 yet again. We are hopping in with the randomized artifacts. We've been enjoying those quite a lot. We're getting choose your items and monsters will spawn double, uh, but their maximum health is halved. That could be interesting. Um, hmm. Hmm. I'm thinking. Let's play as Mercenary. I've not played as Mercenary yet on the channel, and he is pretty fun, so let's get into it. I am currently messaging um, Mr. Never Named over on Discord, so just one moment. Uh, probably make... Right. Let's hop into this. I have not played Commander in a long while, but being able to choose our items should make him considerably better. I cannot remember how to use any of his abilities. I just remember he is one slashy boy. So we got that, we got our slice and dice, and then R is like a sort of dash. Okay. So we got monster spawns are doubled, remember, so we're going to be having quite a lot of boys. Ooh, okay. I like that. I like that. I remember. I remember how this all works now. I remember how this all works now. Okay. Oh my god. He's a ninja. I love him. I love him so much. Okay, I'm trying to think what items are going to be best for us here. Um. Oh my god, yes. I don't know about the, uh, the up slice ability. That doesn't seem that useful. This one. I mean, it's a very short cooldown though, I suppose. Alright, it seems to do different things depending on, like, if you're stood on the floor or not. I see, I see. I get it, I get it. Slice and dice! Oh my god, the dash as well. Oh, wait a minute. Do we get, like, a secondary dash? Oh my god, I've not played this character in so long. I think we get a secondary dash after our primary one. Like, if we kill an enemy, we get another dash. I think that's how that works. So if we go, like this. Let's see. We go like this. Yeah, we get another... Oh my god. Okay, I'm involved with that. I am involved with that. Right. What do we want? Um... Attack speed seems good. I don't, I don't really know what's best to stack with with the commander. I'm guessing attack speed's gonna be a really good one to get off the bat. Just to slice and dice a little quicker. And then we're going to want to start building up some defensive things. I really need to start playing on um, Monsoon as well. Seeing how that goes. Oh my god. Just keep slicing. Just keep slicing. Oh my god. I'm loving this. Just keep dashing. <laughs> okay, this is going to be an interesting, uh, an interesting one. Uh, bosses are a little difficult with Commando. That's the main reason I didn't need to play him that much. Because some bosses can be really difficult with him. Uh, but we'll see. We've been kind of sticking in this corner pretty religiously for the for the most part here. So let's try and uh, make our way somewhere else and find some more chests, shall we? There's another chest. If we found three of the same types of chests already, there's another one of these over here. Okay, so probably don't want to be using our dash like that too much. Um, let's just absolutely stack attack speed for this. Uh, yeah, that seems like by far the best uh, idea for us right now. Just stack attack speed to start with, and then we'll sort of build onto other things. Our green items, I know we want, like, the uh, hoopoo feather. We want to be able to stay in the air. We want um, the wax quail as well, if we can get our hands on a few of those. That'd be nice. Oh, my God. You can be up for three times. That's just tickety-boo, that is. Tickety boo tasty. Alright, let's uh let's do a little run around first. In fact, maybe we want to be stacking some goat hoofs and getting some movement speed going. That'd probably be a good idea. Oh my god, that's just amazing. That'd probably be a good idea. Uh stacking up a bit of movement speed just to get around the place a little bit faster. I think this guy's really gonna benefit from that quite a lot. Um Right. Let's have a little look see here. Come on now. Take you on. Take you on. Take you on. Right, what you got going on? Let's go for more attack speed. Like I said, I'm just going to stack attack speed for now because I don't think we need movement speed yet. Oh my god, that's so powerful. It's insane. Damn it. Okay, we'll probably be able to get one or two more items out of this floor. I haven't checked around the back there yet. These double enemy spawns are actually really incredible for us. Okay, you don't even need to kill enemies, just hit them. The dash works even if you just hit them, you don't even have to kill. Even better. 
Yeah, the double enemy spawns actually work really well for us, I think. If we'd get the one that allows us to use our dash more often, that'd be good. The utility thing. We've got a few bits and bobs up there. We've got an active item, which is nice. Doesn't look like we've got any chests, though, which is a shame. We do have some chests back that way, though. When it's spending... A little bit more time than you would normally spend on this floor here, but I think it's worth it. We'll pop that open. Got a chest here. Uh, let's go for more attack speed. Stack up five of those so far. And what are you going to give us? What do we want from this? Um, let's go with this. Having the ability to group things seems extraordinarily powerful with this character. And we get a bit of defense when we're attacking things, I think. Or after using certain... Yeah, after using certain abilities, we get a bit of defense. You'll see a little icon come up above our level whenever we dash. And do certain attacks. He does very, very good base damage, though. Like, we've not really got too much to up our damage, apart from, obviously, DPS-wise attack speed. So I think he's a, he's a, pretty, he's a pretty fun character, really. I, I don't know why I haven't played him as much as I really should have. Okay, there's our first green. Let's get um, a hoopoo feather straight away. Being able to stay in the air longer with a third jump is going to be very, very important. I did just hit my mic there. I do apologize if that was ridiculously loud. My sincerest apologies. Right. Pop this. And that's not a good boss for us, as I just mentioned earlier. I mean, it's going all right. We're staying up in there nicely. Okay, that's one dead. You can actually kind of hang on to the little tentacles here. And we're getting everything grouped up as well. Okay, you can dash them into the floor. That's even better to know. Nice. Okay, that went, that went very well. And we get ourselves one of these, which is really nice. Uh, we will go with... The extra health and regen. That's always nice to get. Especially while we're up close and in the fray. I would say that's a good idea. We got frozen a little bit there, but don't worry too much about that. We don't get long to do our extra dashes, though. So when we do our dash, we need to be, like, kind of ready for our next one. Do you know what would be really good for us right now? Alien head, something like that, since uh, means we can use our cooldowns more often. Our cooldowns are a big part of our damage here, so... At least this guy's just, like, in the heat of it. He's in the action. It's great. I do realize there's more um, artifacts for me to get and a few more challenges that people have asked for. If anyone's willing to hop on with me and unlock some artifacts, please do let me know, because unlocking artifacts does take some time, and some people are definitely better at this game than I am. So if you if you were willing to hop on with me and just spend a few hours unlocking some artifacts, then please do let me know in the comments, and I will totally add you on Steam, or if I've already got you on Steam, we'll just play some time. I'd be super, super happy to do that. Uh, let's buy that healing drone, because why not? And away we go. Away we go. Right, I've got another message in Discord here. Oh my god. Um, okay, I've got to sort something out after this. i got to sort something out after this. One second. Can I do this? One second. Sorry, guys. Uh... Okay, you got it, you got it. My friend's trying to mod Skyrim, and he was trying to open one of the menus in the game and couldn't figure out how. He was like, how the fuck do I do this? Oh, wait, I got it, I got it. <laughs> right. Let's do a little bit of exploring. We've got a chest here already. Let's kind of stick around this. Primordial Cube is probably one of the better ones for us because it allows us to group up enemies easily, but the bigger thing is when there's double enemy spawns, it means we're grouping up more and more enemies each time we do it, which is great. So... Of course, Gesture of the Drowned is big for us right now. Let's go and see if we can find ourselves our uh, little blue portal activation, because Gesture of the Drowned would be huge. Slice and dice. Why'd I do that? I will never know. Normally, on this level, it can be in a few places, but it's almost always... Yeah, there it is. Up there. That's where you find it 99% of the time. So we have to be careful at getting up there, because we do only have one dash to get up there. Nice. There you go. Extra jumps to help us out. Jump. 
Okay, we've got a lot of these pods about. I'm going to try and group enemies up first. Let's do that. There you go. Got all of them. Take you out. Oh, no. <laughs> I just went to grab him and he's just like, zoom. Later, bitch. I'm out of here. Oh my god, when there's so many enemies, that, that just lasts forever. It just keeps on going and going and going. I love it. I'm such a short cooldown as well. Right, what you got for us? More movement speed we need. That's the wrong one. I didn't mean to pick that. I hope it's okay. Alright, keep going. We can get some stuff going on here. Lots of icy boys. Them ones are the worst for us because we've got to get away immediately. We can attack while sprinting with this guy as well, so that's nice. Right, we've got quite a lot of money now. Let's do some exploring. Do some chest exploring. I see a little drone down there. That's fine, though. I'll leave that for now. Two swings and you're dead. Got ourselves another active item. God damn it. I'm not going to play that anymore. Waste of my money. Uh, Paul's Goat Hoof. There it is. That's the one we want. Let's get a few of those. Get our movement speed really sky high. Good. good. Got enough front of the chest now. There was one around here, wasn't there, that I missed? I thought I'd walk past one here. Maybe not. Maybe not. Right, let's go down that way there. See if we can sort of skirt the edge and make our way back around to the chests we saw early game. Let's do this first, though. We've got quite a lot of boys here. Nice. That's just so much money right there. Got ourselves like an extra hundred right off that. Very easy to, to get. Oh, this is a chest. I thought it was a drone. It is not. Okay, we're starting to get our movement speed really high now. I love the animations for the commando. He's so, just so smooth. So smooth. Just glides through the air. I think after this, we'll start going for crits, maybe? I don't know. You, you don't get that many crits, but his proc coefficient might be a bit higher, so we might get more crits with this guy, although I don't think crits really work on proc coefficient. Good, good. Got you. We had a few following behind us, didn't we? A few. There's like one here, and then like loads behind him. We are. Okay, we got you. We've got Big Boy here. Mr. Big Boy. It stuns them as well, which is nice. Good, good, good. That should give us enough money to keep tide us over. Let's do this. Okay, that's a lot of ice. Let me get away from that. Right. Go, go, Hoof, go. Underle, underle. Hey, you got a green. Uh, let's go for a wax quill. Gonna give us a bit of a boost. Another green. Let's go for. Um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Feather. Really want to get the movement speed going first for this guy. I think that's gonna be most important by far. Able to keep ourselves in the air and on the move at all times is important. We had another chest round here, didn't we, that we missed? Cool. And with this, get ourselves more goat hoof. Oh my god, that's a lot of boys that I hear spawning in. And let's have a look see. I want myself more hoopoo feathers. Stack them up, jump high. Uh, let's go with... Hmm. Utility? What skill does that actually add to? This one. Okay, that's not too bad. Having extra ones of those is nice. Doesn't give it too much, too much extra movement speed, though, but... I had to test it to find out what it would give us. Keep running through here. 
Lovely. And we'll go do our boss now. Where's our boss at? That's so nice. The movement speed we can, like, contain there. What are you, all you doing? Okay, don't press R after dashing. It seems to really balk it up. Where's my boss at? My boss, my boss. Oh, this is so fun, though. Rolling around at the speed of sound. What the hell's our boss? There it is, down here. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Oh my god, this is so fun. Excuse me, sir, you have to die. Got him. There's another one. Oh, of course there's another one. We're playing on that mode where there's always another one. Did it just hit seriously decide to slash that barrel? Right, cool. We're good. Boss time. Who are you going to give us? Beetle Queen. What up, Beetle Boy? Is that just one Beetle Queen? I thought it was always two. I like the way that just took, like, three of those ice beetles and there's, like, nothing else. I don't want anything else. Just the ice beetles, please. And now they're stuffed by the looks of things as well. Strange. Okay, it dead. It big dead. That's, that's some boys I don't care to see. Right. Attack! Wait, is one of these still full health? What are you doing, dude? How? How you do this? Give me my next hoopoo feather. The feather, where is it? Gimme, gimme. Oh my god, there's so many of these. Okay, so the extra dash lasts a little longer if you're attacking by the looks of it. When you, when you do your second and third dashes, they last a little longer. Why are you guys stuck? I don't know what was going on with them guys, but we were all stuck. Oh, that's just my favourite thing. Just my favourite thing. I love it. And slice. And slice. Enter the blue portal. Gesture of the drowned. Gesture of the drowned. Gimme, gimme. Gimme four of them, please. I need them in my life. Boop. Gesture of the drowned. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, and, uh, thank you. Yes! <laughs> I have the power. <laughs> After banner could be good, but no, I'll I'll abstain. Well, t t technically, it could give us any legendary, but yes, I have the power. Oh, and don't you think I'm not going to take a bunch of fuel cells? Don't you even dare think that. Hey, sir, how are you doing with your machine gun? No thanks. Got him. Do, 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 do. <laughs> this is truly... Oh my god, there's more. This is truly rolling around at the speed of sound. Got him. And there's a chest here for us too. We can't even afford it. There's lots of chests around here, actually. Oh, I feel so powerful. What up, boys? How y'all doing today? <laughs> Okay, we're gonna fall them now. Gimme, gimme. Um, more speed. I want a little bit more speed first. Let's get ourselves up to. Uh... Actually, we've got we've got more uh, movement speed than we do attack speed now. So let's uh, let's start switching back over to um, getting some crits, I guess. You think you're so cool? You think you're so cool firing at my drone? That's my healing drone, buddy. Not permitted in these parts. 
Step yourself away from the healing drone. And then we just blast those away. Go to our next chest, wherever that was. There was another one around here, wasn't there? Maybe not. Them guys spawned into the, uh, into the orbit of that and just got sucked in. Give me the suck to free my soul. Okay. We need some fuel cells. Can go for that to get some later. Another chest over here. Jump! I see you there, chest, hiding from me. We are. Oh no, I tried to dodge and just couldn't. Ah, oh, my god, this is... Why haven't I been playing this character more? This is so fun. <laughs> I think I was just convinced that he wasn't very good against bosses. But that's proving to be complete bullshit. Although we are picking out items right now, so that might be why. He's definitely fun when you can pick your items. I'll tell you, there is, there is so many items around here today. What the hell's going on? Where's your buddy? There he is. So many items today. Crits. Once we get up to 10 of these, we get guaranteed crits, so that'll be fun. Right, there's one. We're already at six. Already at six. We're already dealing quite a lot of crits. So I'm up to enough to get this chest now. Pop this one open. There you go. What up, guys? Not of money for me. I need more money. I need more money. That'll that'll give me some money work. Oh, yes, please. Thank you. I don't have a dash. God damn it, my dash. It's up such a long cooldown. Having that on a short cooldown would be so good. Oh, hello. Um, fuel cell, please. I can't remember where fuel cell is. There you go. So that should lower the cooldown down to like 13, 12 seconds, something like that. Let's just stack up as many of those as we can. And we got something cooking. Oh wait, has it gone up to four seconds? Wait a minute, wait a minute here. Oh no, it's 15 now. I don't know what it was at before, but... It's decent, right. Need more items where you all at. Okay, there's our teleporter. I just love the dodge roll he does every time. Boop, 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 boop. Just keep rolling, 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 what? Just keep rolling, 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 what? Crits. Give me the crits to free my soul. And we keep going down here. We'll go over towards our boss now. I think we need like one more hoopy feather, I think. To really get this rolling. What's our boss going to be? Imp Overlord. That's going to be a sucky boss for us, I think. Although, it's dying pretty fast. Did we, have we killed one already? Oh, no, it's over there. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of bleed we're taking right now. Oh, that's a lot of bleed we're taking right now. Oh, God. Oh, Lordy. This boy does not do well against these guys. Okay, we just got to kind of stay in the air and away from all the riffraff. I think these guys are the main cause of our trauma, though. Like, there is... What the hell's going on with these guys? Stop getting stuck, you weirdos. It's when he does that attack where he hits the floor. If you're in radius for that, not good. I think one of these bosses is almost dead. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, my God. Oh, Lord. This is tough. Like, this... this yeah, like I said, this guy just doesn't perform well against some bosses. This is one of them. I'm probably just playing him wrong. Okay, we managed to kill everything. 
fuel cell. So we're at 15 seconds. What are we at now? 14. It's literally a second off pair one. So we only need 14 fuel cells. And then we're good to go. Wait, no, that time it was like a three second cooldown. What happened there? 14. That's weird. Sometimes it like skips some seconds. I don't know why. Or maybe I'm just reading it wrong. Let's do it. Let's keep her going. Let's keep her going. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're just coming into the next level of insane difficulty here. Oh, hello. How might you be? Um, let's save ourselves some pain and torture. For one, let's get ourselves that bad boy that I missed completely. Give me you. Give me those eggs, boy. Um, I'm going to go around and try and find... Yeah, I don't care about you enemies. I want to find my eggs. Take me to the eggs. I know where most of them are, but there's some weird spawning with some of them. Okay, there's, there's two of those. Like there should be. But I'm just confirming that fact. More eggs. Any eggs over here? I can never remember if there's any spawns over here. I don't see any over here. It's always more difficult when they don't all spawn at the top. Because you can randomize the location. If they all spawn at the top, then it's just easy to grab them all. But it looks like we don't have that luxury today. We're going to have to actually do some proper searching. Some proper searching for those eggs. Um, I think there's always some on here. Oh, I love that sound. Yeah. Oh, my God. They're right next to each other. Got them both. Is there any over this bit here? There's some, I think. Yep, there's some. I think we got it. Did we get it? Yeah, we got it. It's time, boys. Now, I don't know how successful this is going to be, but we shall attempt to kill these things. Honestly, our damage isn't really that high, so I don't think this is going to be too easy. Like, all the stuff that we've got has been a lot of movement speed stuff, so our damage isn't crazy. The ba the main damage ups we have... Oh, my God. The main damage ups we have, actually, are... Um, when to kill that guy. Salamander, years ago. Uh, is actually our crits. Everything else isn't really damage. I suppose we have attack speed. Just kind of damage, basically. Okay, that guy's dead. But as you can see, even when we're focusing down one, we're still taking heavy damage. We should be okay, though. I say that not knowing at all if we'll be okay or not. The fact that we're pulling everything into a nice, neat pile is also nice. Oh, no, we got frozen. Okay, that was, that was almost terrible. Certain aspects of this are very, very, very terrible. I love the way that we've just kind of pinned him into the floor. Oh, God. Oh, I'm almost dead. Ah, leave me alone, you big bitch. My god, that was a lot of explosions. Let's get out there. Oh, how we were so low HP all the time. Just don't be like that, dude. Okay, he's doing his thing. I think while we're in the air... Oh my god, we yeeted him. Oh my god, that did so much damage too. Can we just yeet them everywhere? Can we just absolutely smack them into the floor and just have done with it? How did we do that? That, like, okay, so the last one, we killed one with a yeet. Did we double yeet? We double yeeted? Oh my god. <laughs> we did the double yeet. That's such a good way of killing those. Oh my god. Just use the last dash to yeet them into the floor. It kills them instantly. I didn't know about this. I almost just died there, though. Be careful. Um, yeah, we need to heal up a bit. Our, our health drone's still alive somehow, which is just nice, but also baffling. Okay, good. Getting rid of those orbs that keep attacking us is good. 
Right, um, I can never remember which, which one it is. I think it's this one. Yes, kills reduce equipment cooldown. That's the one we wanted. This should make this should make our uh, active ability pretty insane. Right, let's go get some chests. Pop you open. We still need a few more crits. We need one more crit glasses. Let's look for that. There you go. We got full crits now. Let's keep going on attack speed, shall we? Got so much money, my god. God damn, there's chests everywhere this floor. Hey guys, how are you? You're dead. That's how you're doing. The wood shrine. Let's keep flying up here. Oh my god. Got whatever this is here. Equip emergency. Is that emergency drone or equipment drone? Repair emergency drone. I don't even know what that does. Is that like when we get low health, it doesn't attack us? Anymore? What are you doing over here? You're a bit stuck. Okay, let's get another hoopoo feather because we needed one. We didn't need one. We won one. Uh, attack speed. More chests. My god, they're everywhere. Oh, we don't have enough anymore. My god, we've run out of money. Since when? Okay, we've got a few more guys over here that are willing to sacrifice themselves to us. And that'll be it, I think. Ow. Ooh, we got a green. Uh, let's go with Crit's Heal. That should be a good amount of healing. If we can get a few of those, we'll have a good amount of healing. What the hell is this guy doing? Are you okay? He's making it sound like he's not okay. You look like you're in pain, fella. <laughs> it's just unable. Eat against the ground. I, I don't know what's going on with this guy, but he is not okay. I'll, I'll, I'll kill him just to give him mercy. What up, guys? Right, let's see what boss is. Magma worm, please no. Damn you! <laughs> I was like, don't be a magma worm. Don't be a magma worm. It's a magma worm. I can imagine the magma worm's really annoying to fight as this guy. Oh no, I don't know. He, he might be really easy, but it, it seems like it'd be really hard. Also, them two jumped in unison then, and it was actually beautiful. Okay, the R attack seems to be, like, the best attack to use against these. There's a lot of ice guys down there that really ain't gonna be easy to deal with all at once. That's a lot of ice explosions. I think, what, is one of them dead? Or is one of them just hecked off? Yeah, one of them's dead. I, I don't know how I didn't get frozen there, but I'll accept it. My god, the healing's so strong. Also, look at all the... <laughs> oh, this is so beautiful. Oh my god, we're almost dead. Oh my god, we died. What the hell killed me? Did the magma worm kill me? Oh my god, that was unexpected. <laughs> Holy heck, but yes, we'll definitely play as the Commando again in the future if you guys enjoyed that. Either way, I know it's a bit of a shorter episode, but we did end up dying. Um, we made it decently far. We got to our last stage, or second to last stage, should I say now. Yep, yeah, either way, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.